Hello everybody and welcome back to the NASCAR Thunder 2003 Let's Play. We're in Las Vegas, Nevada, home of the Las Vegas Motor Speedway for the running of the UAW Daimler Chrysler 400. This is race three of the NASCAR Thunder 2003 Let's Play. So let's get this show on the road. NASCAR Winston Cup Racing has hit the jackpot this week as we come to Las Vegas Motor Speedway for today's UAW Daimler Chrysler 400. I'm Joe Moore along with Barney Hall. We'll be bringing you all the action right here on the MRN. What kind of thing should we look for in this one, Barney? Well, I think we'll see lots of green flag racing in this one. The track is wide and smooth and there are multiple grooves to work with here. Sometimes the cars can get very spread out in this one. We saw quite a finish here at Las Vegas in 1999 when Jeff Burton edged out his older brother, Ward, for the win. That wasn't the only time that happened in 99. Ward finished runner-up to Jeff three times in 99, making Ward wait until 2000 for his second trip to Victory Lane. Here come the Jets flying over the track as the national anthem ends. And the engines are fired and we're ready for racing at Las Vegas. As everybody raced for a million dollars on the line. Let's take a look at the entire starting lineup presented by EA Sports. It's in the game. In the front row are Jimmy Spencer and Mark Martin. In row two, we have Dale Jarrett and Todd Bodine. In row three are Ricky Rudd and Dale Earnhardt Jr. This season's point leader will start the race from the sixth place. Junior's the point leader and the Daytona 500 winner. In row four, we have Greg Biffle and Daytona 500 pole setter Jimmy Johnson, a rookie. In row five, we have Rusty Wallace and Shane Hall. We're on Shane Hall's roof right now. In row six, we have Magnum 05's Ken Schrader and Scott Wimmer, a rookie. In row seven, we have Kevin Harvick and Elliot Sadler. In row eight, we find Kyle Petty and Ryan Newman, a rookie. In row nine, we have Sterling Marlin and interesting for ours, Jeff Gordon, the Rockingham winner from last race. In row 10, we find Tony Stewart and Kurt Busch. In row 11, we find Terry Labonte and Bobby Labonte, the Labonte brothers. In row 12, we find Shauna Robinson, a rookie, and Jeff Green in the American Online car. In row 13, we find Johnny Benson and Jeremy Mayfield. In row 14, we find John Andretti and Steve Park. In row 15, we find Bill Elliott and Ward Burton. In row 16, we find Jeff Burton and Casey Atwood. In row 17, we find Jerry Nadeau and Jeff Purvis. In row 18, we find Matt Kenseth and Michael Waltrip. In row 19, we find Frank Kimmel and Robbie Gordon. In row 20, we find Bobby Hamilton and Mike Skinner. In row 21, we find Jamie McMurray and Ricky Craven. And rounding out the field is Casey Kane. Time to get this Las Vegas un race underway. The green flag is out and we are underway in the Valley of Nevada. Already into the top five. And... Oh, oh, that's going to be three wide for the lead. 
Oh dear. Darn it. I'd say that slide job didn't work. It was a slide job gone bad. My fault. Dale Jarrett gets five bonus points for leading up lap. Oh, Jeter bumps into Jarrett, moves him out of the groove, and moves into the lead. Now here comes Spencer for the lead. Going to try to bring Mark Martin in the six car with him. Followed by Ricky Rudd in the 28 car. That's five bonus points for Dale Earnhardt Jr. Oh! The 41 just got into me. And now Ricky Rudd is joining J Dale Earnhardt Jr. in a battle for the lead. All right, here comes Rudd to the inside. He's under Earnhardt. Jeter moves to the outside, trying to clear run. He does, and keeps the lead. Five laps to go. I see a silver car coming. I can't tell who it is. It looks like Kevin Harvey. All right, we're coming to halfway. Four laps to go. Rudd trying desperately with four laps to go to get the lead from Dale Earnhardt Jr. along with Jimmy Spencer, Mark Martin, and Jimmy Johnson. to go and Junior continues to hold his ground. Oh, caution flag is out. Three laps to go and the caution flag is out. All right, guys, slow her down. Back her down. Caution is out. Oh, they're going to let the leaders race each other back to the line. Earnhardt Junior, Spencer, and Mark Martin racing nose to tail and side by side. Oh, here comes Martin to the inside. So Dale Earnhardt Jr. will lead under caution with Mark Martin in second and Jimmy Spencer in third. Let's take a look at, at the replay of why we're under caution presented by EA Sports. John Andretti in the 43 and Matt Kenseth in car number 17. Andretti and Kenseth got together along with another car. I believe it's car number 25 driven by Jerry Nadeau. It's going to be a two-lap shootout. Green flag is back underway. Who's going to win it all? Earnhardt Jr., Martin, Spencer, Rudd, Johnson. Oh, excuse me. That's Jarrett, I believe. Yep, it is Dale Jarrett. Here we come to the white flag. Dale Earnhardt Jr. after his second win of the season. The white flag is in the air. One more lap to go. Presented by Credit One Bank. The official credit card of NASCAR. Oh, here comes, here comes Jared to the inside. Here comes Harvick. Joining with them as well. Oh, Jeter and Jared are side by side for the lead. Oh, Jared gets loose. Here they come off turn four for the final time. Dale Earnhardt Jr. wins Las Vegas. With Mark Martin, Dale Jarrett, Kevin Harvick, Jimmy Johnson, Jimmy Spencer, Tom O'Dine, Kyle Petty, Rusty Wallace, and Tony Stewart rounding out the top ten. Uh, I'm going to give the, these fans a little bit of a smoke burnout or some fun. Not very many
caution laps in this one. Well, that was good news to the guys who ran out front. More cautions would just have meant more restarts, which is more chances for you to lose positions. Dale Earnhardt Jr. is the big winner in this one. And rightfully so. He was fast all race long. That whole team deserves a lot of credit for a great win. This is Joe Moore for Barney Hall saying thanks for joining us for today's NASCAR Winston Cup race. Next up is Atlanta. Let's take a look at the Victory Lane celebration. Here comes Junior out of the car to celebrate his second win of the season. Let's take a look at the rest of the race results. 11 through 43rd, Sterling Marlin, Kurt Busch, Bobby Labonte, Ken Schrader, Ryan Newman, Terry Labonte, Bill Elliott, Jeff Burton, Greg Biffle, and Elliott Sadler. The top 20, the 21st through 30th, we have Scott Wimmer, Jeremy Mayfield, Jeff Gordon, Johnny Benson, Shane Hall, Michael Waltrip, Steve Park, Rashawn Robinson, Ward Burton, and Jerry Nader, the top 30. The rest on the field, Casey Abbott, Jeff Green, Frank Kimmel, Bobby Hamilton, Robbie Gordon, John Andretti, Mike Skinner, Ricky Craven, Matt Kinseth, Jeff Purvis, Casey Kane, Jamie McMurray, and Ricky Rudd. Only completed five laps and is out of the race. That's too bad. Rudd needed a great finish today. Jeff Gordon cannot be very happy with the 23rd place finish. There's always next time. Let's take a look at the points. Gordon only dropped one spot, 12 in the points. The next race, the NBA America 500 at Atlanta. We'll see you next time.